Hi guys, and welcome back to another video. Um, yeah, we're back! Hi! I have been not- I haven't recorded a video in such a long time. It feels really weird. Because, okay, I have been so incredibly busy. Like, I have not been at my house in a really long time. Like, I've been traveling and riding my horses and just doing a whole lot of stuff. I've been competing on my horses and practicing and stuff like that and I've just been really busy and plus school and regular life too so yeah I've just been super busy and I haven't recorded a video in a really long time and so yeah but I'm really happy to be back I have a little bit of spare time today so I thought I would jump on and record a video um so yeah so today I just wanted to give a tour of my home stable um, I've never done this before on my channel, and at first I was kind of like, I don't really want to do one because, like, I oh don't know, my stable changes so much all the time that I didn't think there was much of a point, but then I was like, you know what, this could be kind of fun. So, yeah. So, this is my home stable. I know it looks very different from everyone else's home stable. It's, it's very unique. Um, yeah. So, I guess we'll start over here. So, kind of the way this door won't close. I've been trying to get it to close for the last 10 minutes and it won't close. So, um, you're gonna have to deal with that. But basically, I arrange my horses by um, which ones I'm training. So, I try to make sure I train my horses. I bought quite a few horses without training other horses. So, that's why I have a lot of horses to train. So, right now I'm training my Morgan, uh, Silver Dollar. Um, she doesn't have a nickname yet. I just kind of call her Silver or Sylvie. Kind of like, yeah, that's that's her nickname. That's her nickname. And then we have Chip or Chip Dip. I actually bought him in a video I recorded. I just never finished editing it. I might finish editing it. It's from a couple Wednesdays ago, but I never finished. I didn't have time to finish editing it, and then the Wednesday kind of got far away. But maybe I'll just post it just for fun. But yeah, so that's Chip Dip. And then further down the training line, we have Peach. She's a Gen 2 Halflinger. I've always wanted a Gen 2 Halflinger, and so I finally just decided to get one. I think Peach is level 6. I rode her around for quite a bit. Um, and then we have Olive Garden, or Olive. This is like literally my dream horse right here. This might be the new channel mascot, who knows. I'm thinking of like not having a channel mascot anymore and just having horses that just kind of circle through a lot of picture. I don't know. And then those are the horses I have to train. I just keep them right here because that way like, I don't know, I can see them like get trained and move up the line. It's kind of satisfying. Um, and then right here is Sandy, uh, my Belgian warm blood. I really like this horse. She's, wait, he's really cute. I think this is a boy. Yeah. He's really cute. Um, I ride him quite often. And then we have Big Boy from my Christmas shopping spree, like, last year, I think. And he is so precious. I love him so much. I want to get another American paint. I kind of want the medicine hat American paint because I love the American paints. I love their gates and just, they're so perfect. And then over here, we have Milk, who's a very iconic horse in my friend group on Star Stable. He's very much just a favorite. Yes, we love Milk. He's, he's a king, an iconic king. He's my, my Mawari. Um, and yeah, I think I bought him. I don't remember when I bought him, but I, know I, I think I bought him in a video. And then we have Moon Dancer. He's a Pasifino. I actually did a dressage lesson on him the other day, and it was really fun. I have not done dressage in such a long time. It was really fun. And then we have Thunder, my Appaloosa. Don't mind that some of the horses have halters on them. I was like putting halters on all my horses, but then I kind of gave up like halfway through. So yeah. And then we have Angel, my Arabian, and she has like, oh never mind. It says she has boots on, but she actually doesn't. That's, that's cool. I don't really know why she would have those on, but you know, it's okay. I love her. She's definitely like one of my favorite horses I have. Okay, then moving down here in between like these two stalls, we have Classy Twilight or just Class. I love this horse. I know the Napstrippers aren't as popular anymore, but 
I still really like this horse. I haven't ridden him in a while, but I, I know. I just love this horse. He's so cute, and he has, like, so many good memories attached to him. And then we have Saint, my other English thoroughbred. I think I have three English thoroughbreds. Yes, so he's one of the three. He is so pretty. I love him. We have Chocolate Milk, or just Chalky, or Chocolate. One of my many gotlins. I'm trying to collect all the gotlins, so I think I just need three more to have them all. Yeah, I have a small obsession. And then over here, we have my Chingatee Pony Mouse. She is so cute and so dainty. I just love her. Like, she's just so cute. I can never get over how cute this pony is. And yeah, she's definitely, like, I don't ride her that much, but I just love having her in my stable because she is just so cute. And then we have Coffee Cup, or I think I either named this horse, I think I named her Latte. I'm pretty sure is what Coffee Cup, her, like, nickname is, is Latte. I'm, like, 95% sure, but I might have to look at my buying Halflinger video to confirm that. But... I love this horse. I think she looks so just perfect and I really should ride her more because she is like gorgeous. I just, I can never get over how pretty this horse is. And then I have Arctic Crystal or Blizzy. I really hate her nickname. It is so bad. Like, I don't know why I thought Blizzy was his nickname. So I might change her name soon because like, ugh, she deserves better. I need to find like a better name for her. I can name her something so pretty, and then I named her Arctic Crystal. I don't know why I did that. <sighs> but yeah, so those are all my horses that I have chilling in my stable right now. It switches around quite a bit. I would say this area stays about the same most of the time, but it does switch around quite a bit. Uh, inventory, I organize it by. Do I organize it by color? And so we have red orange yellow green so we have these t-shirts and then i have my blue t-shirts purple t-shirts and my pink t-shirts or like short sleeve shirts and then it repeats again but with long sleeve um tops so we have red orange green blue pink or purple pink and then i have all my black and white and gray stuff right here um this can all fit on one page so i have it all on one page then I have all my dresses that I literally never wear. I have not touched any of these in a really long time. This is probably the only one I have worn more than once, I will be completely honest. I actually really like this dress. Okay, and then I have pants, kind of same thing. It goes in order-ish. I have like brown and orange kind of lumped together. And then, yeah, and then I just have the uh, blacks, whites, and grays all in one section with skirts at the very end. Um, shoes, exact same thing. And then I have like shorter shoes that I don't generally would choose not to wear. I don't really wear these shoes that often because, you know, I don't try to wear sandals because we still don't have toes. Um, yeah. And then I have all my flower crowns. I have way too many flower crowns. When these were at the Midsummer Festival, I just bought them all. So, um, yeah, I think I have almost every flower crown that you can possibly buy. I even have two of the same one. Um, and then I have my black head hats, helmets, stuff white, red, brown, slash orange, and then green, blue, and all that. I don't know how. But these are, they gifted this twice. I don't know if Star Stable realizes that. But they gifted this in a quest and then they gifted this for Christmas. So, thanks Star Stable. Um, and then, you know, I have a birth, I have a cake in here too. So if anyone ever gets hungry, like, let me know. I have actually two cakes, so take that. If you don't have, if you really have one cake, I got two. So, um, yeah, ha. Huh. I have gloves. My gloves are pretty pretty boring. I pretty much only wear my black fingerless gloves. And if I don't wear those, 
I wear the Northern Dewy Gloves. For skier, I actually just redid this, so it's like really fresh. So I have all my English saddles, my black English saddles, brown English saddles, um, white, and then random colors. And then I have my Western saddles, black, brown, random colors. And then I have black bridles, and these are kind of like sorted vaguely into the types of bridles they are. And then, um, and I have white bridles and then random colored bridles. And then all my roselles are right here. And I have my saddle pads, and they're arranged by color as well. And then I have boots, which are arranged by color. And then we have decorations, so I have all my champ ribbons. I have never won a champ, which is actually kind of sad. I'm level 21 and have not ever won a champ. I got second, third, you know, but I, I've never won a champ, which I feel like I need to, I feel like I need to fix that at some point. Maybe that can be my next adventure, but yeah, it's kind of sad. And I have all my um, horses, flower crowns. That, yep, there, that's a lot of flower crowds. And then I have tail accessories, and then saddle bags. I honestly only use like three of these saddle bags, and then the rest just kind of sit here and collect dust, which is a little sad. And then I have horseshoes that have stats, which all two of them, and then my actually really good horseshoes are, are during on the horse. I'm training. And then. These are all just starter gear horseshoes. I just take them off and put them in here sometimes. Not all of them are in here. A lot of my horses still have them on. But if I just notice they have them on when I'm like riding them or something, I just take them off and put them in here because why not? Okay, and then we have my pets, which we have bunnies, cats, birds, foxes, and then we have squirrels, the spider, dog, holiday pets, and then we have plushies, items, a gnome, balloons, and then like these little like books and stuff that like fit really nicely in the saddle bags. So yeah, that's where those are and then the rest of it is just empty. And then finally my items, we have quest items, um, and I guess I also have uh, my papers down here and then we have horse food, um, people food, and then building stuff, magic, whatevers, and then I have all the tokens and random like currencies for all the festivals, and then I have fireworks, and then the furniture, which, yeah, is, is still sitting here. Um, and then we have my all the bones, and then some of my uh, Farah collecting stuff. So like, if I get something and it fills up, I just take it back here and then put it in there so it, I don't have to worry about it getting over overflowing stuff. So yeah, that's going to wrap up today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and yeah, comment down below how many times you upgraded your home stable. Um, I don't know how many times I have. I think I've done it twice. So yeah, pretty sure I've upgraded my home stable twice. So yeah, comment down below how many times you've upgraded your home stable. And I hope you enjoyed. Have a marvelous day. Bye!